come in, come in. Welcome to my crib. Technically, it isn't my crib. It's a hub, but like, anyway. I'm Elle, I'm an illusion witch, and I'm here to show you what's what in this magical little world. First up, my witch tower. This is where- Actually, before we start, your camera's like a bit old. Do you mind if I fix that up? Oh no, I I don't have a spell for this. Let me just- Okay, um, if I could just- if I could Get the bloody thing and- Ow, okay, uh- Welcome! Welcome! This is my tower. Uh, this is my base for trading, and it was where I was first brought when I received the letter from the Grand Supreme. Dearest Illusion Witch, you've been chosen to participate in the witching event of the century. In the event of my death, I always knew that someone would have to rise to take my place as Supreme Witch, which is why I've devised a series of games to determine my successor. Eight witches, one winner. Will you come out on top? Follow the North Star during the witching hour. It will show you the way. Yours truly, the Supreme Witch. Yep, that is definitely what they sounded like. Anyway, uh, I wasn't really bothered about it at first, but it looked like fun, and I might meet some new people to pull pranks on, so why not? But why are you running away? I guess, I guess I'll be battling it out for Supreme Witch. Carrying on, if we go up top, this is my guy Celery. Lovely chap, not quite as bitter as the vegetable, but I can trade with him and increase my powers here, so pretty cool. All I need to do is give him some of these gems, and uh, I think if I can get enough, he'll give me some runes, and from that, I can get brand new abilities. There's actually another lady down at the bottom if you just follow me. No, 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 you'll, you'll be fine. Like, if you jump, I'll just I'll just use my magic. Oh no, oh no, oh dear. I'll just hold the camera myself then. Um, I think there's a necromancer witch, so don't worry. Um, I'll contact him and he'll make them all better later, probably. Introducing Bertha. She's got all kinds of things I can trade with her for those much needed gems. So I think I think we're good to go. I mean, I ought to find somewhere to set myself up. I've got a lot to start preparing. And I mean, what's a witch without her hut? Watcher, we were not, in fact, ready to go because I had, in fact, forgotten all of my mortal belongings, including my witch's hat. So I headed back to the tower. Okay, there we go. I've got everything now. And as you can see, I've got my very nice little witch hat. I think it's very good. The color really suits me. Um, Priz has also left a little gift, but I'm going to wait to pick that up until I've got somewhere that I'm settled down. So I've got somewhere safe to keep it. So let's head out. I think I think first I want to find somewhere to live. Uh, maybe get a little pet, a little guy. Um, and really, I need a broom, so all this traveling isn't so difficult. Uh, but I have to go to the nether for that, so I don't know if that'll be happening today. My powers are, are not super strong, and, um, that sounds like a lot of hassle, so I think we'll just see. I think we'll just see. I very quickly realized I had literally nothing and should probably go get some resources, so that's what I did while I explored. Sir, I hear a skeleton. Are you made of bones? Where is this, this man? Reveal yourself! Oh no. Oh no. Okay. 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 I don't actually know- Ah, oh, okay. No, I, I know I'm not fighting you. One's enough, thank you. I should probably explain here. My power causes blindness. It doesn't work super well on skeletons because they- Well, they don't have eyes, so... Like, if I want to win this thing, I need to get some better spells. I don't actually know if my, um, my spell did anything there. Um, but I, I, I won. I won. And that's all that matters, right? Oh my gosh, who would have- What are these little guys down here? Those are some fancy looking fish. Hello, are you koi? Are you a koi? Are you a- I- I think the only- Oh no. Am I gonna have to kill it to find out? That's a koi, right? No, I can't kill it. No, I can't. I can't. I can't do that. I can't. Okay. After exploring a couple of biomes, I found my very first friend in the world. N uh, in- in this world. Not in- in the world. I have friends. What- why's the ground on fire? What's happened here? <gasps> a bird. Maybe he'll show me the way. Hello. Hi. Hello. No, come back. Please come back. Hello. Hi. Would you... How do I... What do you... Do you like apples? Apple. Apple. A penny for your thoughts. Apple for your friendship? No. I don't think it wants to be friends. Ka. 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 Hello? Have I said something to upset you? Mm-hmm. Okay. Ka ka. Consider this. Ka! Oh. Oh, I've 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 clearly gotten said the wrong thing. 
Well, this isn't quite where I'm... Okay, yeah, well, you made your point. This isn't quite where I wanted to live. This looks quite, um... Oh, this is actually very nice, but... I don't know. Purple's not really my colour, you know? It's very pretty, but I don't think this is for me. After that didn't go so well, I decided to continue my search for the best place to live, and I met some more friends. Well, what's over here? <gasps> Hi! Hello? Hello? Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Hi, do you want to be friends? Do what? Oh my god. Oh my gosh. <gasps> Look at you. No, stay away. Get away. Get away. Away. Be, be gone. Oh. Be gone. Ow. G go. Bah. Well, that sort of worked. I think I'll stick to the otters. Things weren't really going my way, so I decided to steal from the villagers to make myself feel okay, better. Okay, well, I guess I'll see if there's anything good in here. No, there's not. Okay, some sticks. That's quite helpful. And, um... Oh, some melons. All right, okay, that's a little bit of food. Hmm. Hmm. <gasps> oh, hello! Hmm, ha, hmm. What are we trying to do? What are we... Where are we trying to go? Do you want to get out? You guys, you you're blocking the door. Yeah, it's not a door. You know that's not a door. You guys aren't very smart. Oh, a witch. Hello. Are you one of the seven? Are you one of one of us? Supreme witch? <gasps> I I don't think she's one of us. After that ordeal, I decided to try and get some gems. So into the mines I went. Turns out, you don't need to bother mining. You just you just go back and steal more from the village that you found earlier on. There were loads of melons there. Bertha, my sweet, I have goods for you. Okay, that's quite a lot, actually. Um, I don't have... I gathered a small amount of iron and went to go see if this would make the beautiful Bertha happy and give me some gems. Thanks, guys. Good work. Hi, sweetums. I'm home again. Oh, yeah. There we go. Look at that. First gem. Oh, look. She's so proud. She's so proud, isn't she? Gem acquired, I ventured out again and found an area to live that suited me. Okay, I think I found where I want to live. Um, we're surrounded by nice colours that sort of match my outfit. And there's a nice little uh, plateau here that if I chop, chop a couple trees down, I think we've got plenty of space to build a nice little house. And uh, if you don't know, the, the towers are just over that way, so they're not too far. Um, I think this would be perfect. Um, so... I guess with the power of magic, I will go and build a little house. Um, and even though it will take me a very, 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 very long time, it'll appear only minutes or maybe even moments for you. And just like that, my house is finished. Well, it's not quite finished because I haven't done the inside yet and I want to take some time to, to make the outside look really pretty, add some flowers and pizzazz. Um, but we can go check it out. What the heck? Where is that? What is that noise? Oh my. Oh, 
Give over, would you? 